Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are at CVS. We are here to do some deals for the week of the 10th through the 16th of July. And I did take last week off, so I hope everyone had a great 4th of July. I had a really good 4th of July. And then my daughter, she was home for the week and we celebrated 4th of July and my dad's birthday. We went to the beach. It was absolutely beautiful and breathtaking and amazing. So I had a really good time and a really good break and I'm happy to be back. So we got some pretty good deals this week. I don't have a ton of deals that I am doing only because it's one of those weeks where my CRTs don't line up with the sales. And that happens every so often and it's okay. It's not that big of a deal. I still got some really good things to show you and excited to share. So we do have the 14 days of extra freebies that everyone that has an extra care card will get. Those will be sent to your app every day and you can send them to your card, which you'll have to do to use. It will extend it a day. And I did hear that if you print it out and store it, it extends it by two days. Um, I'm not gonna be able to go to the store every day and do the freebies only because I live quite a ways, well, I live like 30 minutes away from a CVS and I won't be able to come in every day. But on Sunday, I did do a curbside pickup for the first aid case. And I did show that in my community or in the community tab. And then I also showed it on Instagram. And I'll share that with you later on in the video. So we will be getting freebies every day. Today, the day that I am doing this video, you will get $3 that you can use towards a CVS first aid item. And if you get multiple, then you can either get three $3 items or you can get a $9 item. It just, it depends on what you get because that's the thing. Some people are getting multiples, some people aren't getting any, and that is unfortunate. But we'll talk about that a little bit later. So anyways, guys, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I am Sarah, and I like to show you how to save money any way that I can. There is a Google Doc link down below in the description box for you to use to help you plan your trip or to help you out in store. And I can't believe I have that memorized. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, let's go inside, guys, and see what we can do. So the first thing we're grabbing is some Maybelline. This week, the Maybelline is buy two, get back a $5 extra buck. And when I seen this online and that my store had it, I was full lord. This was an Ulta exclusive, and now it's been released in other stores. This stuff is like my holy grail foundation. I wear it all the time. It is $13.49. We're also going to grab a Maybelline Green Edition product. This is a balmy lip blush. You can use it for your lips or for your cheeks. And these are $10.29. So both products will equal out to $23.78. I have these printable coupons that I got from the Maybelline website a while back. This is the last day that I can use them. So I'm going to use two of these. Then I'm gonna use that $3 off instant coupon that we got this week. I only have one of them, as well as a four off of 20 Maybelline CRT. So that'll bring my total down to $12.78, but I'll get back a $5 extra buck. Then I'm gonna submit my receipt to Ibotta and I will get back $2 on Ibotta for the lip blush. That'll make my total $5.78 for both of them, which might seem high, but I promise you we're going to get some really good deals and it will make these a much better price. So next we're going to do the spend 30, get back a $10 extra buck and it's on laundry products this week. And I'm going to grab this one right here that's hiding. I love the pods of this version. So this is $12.99. Now I have an eight off of 40 CRT that I'm going to use. So I'm going to grab some other items and I'll go over everything after I grab everything. I just think it's much easier that way. So I grabbed a Tide Pods. I'm also going to be grabbing two of these Downy Scent Beads. They're $5.49 as well. So the total for the Spend 30 get back a $10 extra buck is going to be $29.46. Next, I'm gonna grab some CVS first aid items because of the 14 days of freebies. Today, we get $3 towards CVS first aid items, but I got three CRTs, which makes 
it $9 for free for me. We also have a promotion where you spend $12 and first eight items, you get back a $3 extra buck. So I am going to go for that promotion. So I'm going to grab this CVS Bug Bite and Sting Stick for $6.99. And then I'm going to grab this CVS Itch Relief Spray. It's the version of a Benadryl spray. So that is $6.79, making my total for the both products $13.78. So now that is everything that I'm grabbing for my eight off of 40. So everything that I grabbed is equaling out to $43.24. So I'm going to be using coupons from the July P&G. I have a $2 Tide liquid coupon, a dollar downy coupon, and a dollar Tide pod coupon. I'm also going to be using a dollar off a downy digital coupon as well. Then we're going to use those CRTs for the CVS first date items that will take $9 off. So that's going to bring everything to $21.24, but we'll get back a $10 extra buck for the Tide and Downy, making all of these products just $10.24, which it's like buying the Tide liquid and getting the rest for free, which I think is an incredible deal considering how much things are, uh, the prices are rising and everything like that. So I'm super happy with this transaction. Now in the next transaction, we're doing a little bit of a splurge. So I'm grabbing the Kristen S items. The hair care here is buy two, get back a $6 extra buck. And this stuff is crazy expensive, but I really want to try it out. I love the light pink bottle. So I'm going to grab the shampoo and conditioner here for $16 and 79 cents a piece. Now the two of these will equal out to $33.58. Now this isn't going to be free, but I'm going to get a good chunk off of these items. So I definitely wanted to share it with you in case you're interested. So we have a $2 off of two instant coupon. I got three of those. So that's going to take $6 off. Then I have a four off of 18 hair care CRT that I'm going to use. That's going to bring my total down to $23.58, but I have a 40% off of one item CRT that I'm going to use. So that 40% off coupon will come off after all of the other coupons. So that means our total is $23.78 and it's only coming off one item. So we need to divide it by two to get the math for this. So $23.58 divided by two is $11.79. So now you can figure your 40% off of $11.79. And 40% off of $11.79 equals $4.72. I know that's a lot of math, but then our total will be $18.86. We'll get back a $6 extra buck, making both of them $12.86, coming from $33 down to $12, I don't think that's too bad. So now we're going to grab some freebies and we don't have any promotions for Hallmark, but I have two, three off two Hallmark CRTs. So the bag is $3.99 and the paper I think is adorable with it is $1.99. So both of these will be free. So then I'm going to grab some Tylenol. I was going to grab the Motrin, but the Motrin for the small boxes was all gone. But this is just the same thing to me. So I'm going to grab one of the Tylenols for $6.59. We have a dollar instant coupon in our app, but my account got three of them. Plus we have a $2 off digital coupon. So that'll make this bottle here just $1.59, which I think is a really good deal. It's only a quarter more than what you would pay at the $1.25 tree. <laughs> so we're starting another transaction and we're going to grab the GSQ items. They're buy two, get back a $4 extra buck. I am grabbing this little package here of Q-tips for $4.49. And then I'm going to grab a nail file for $4.99. Now my store isn't marked, but rest assured this is a promotion. And I'm going to pair this with some other items for a 32% off your full purchase 
CRT that I have. But the two of these equal out to $9.48. I have a $3 off at Beauty Tools CRT for GSQ items and a dollar off GSQ app only coupon. So then that's going to bring my total down to $5.48, excuse me. But I'll get back a $4 extra buck, making both of these just $1.48. Now I'm gonna grab a bottle of Essie nail polish. This is not on a promotion or anything like that, but the regular ones here are $9, and I have four $2 off Essie nail polish CRTs, so I'm definitely gonna grab that, making this only a dollar, and I'll also get 32% off. Next, we're going to do the Cetaphil. The Cetaphil is on promotion where you buy two, you get back a $4 extra buck, and I am grabbing two of the wipes here for $9.29. That is so high for wipes. So the two of these will equal out to $18.58. I have two $4 off printable coupons. And how I keep getting these is I go to the Cetaphil website and I sign up for their emails. Now, we all know that people have multiple email addresses, but after you know two or three email addresses, you run out of chances to get them. So instead, just take one of your emails and add a dot in the email, and it will get rerouted back to your main email address. So if your name is Jane Doe 773 and you put Jane Doe 773, it will get rerouted to your original email address. And so that's how I keep getting the printables for these. So after the printables, that will bring my total down to $10.58, but I'll get back a $4 extra buck, making my total $6.58. But I'm also going to submit my receipt to Ibotta, and I'll get back $2.50 off of each one of them. So that'll make my final total for both packages of wipes just $1.58, and I think that is an incredible deal. So next is a deal on the trial and travel section. It is spend 20, you get back a $5 extra buck, which we don't normally get a spend deal like that. And it's actually pretty easy to get to $20 on trial and travel items. I promise I'm not trying to tear apart the shelf. So I'm going to grab this poopery here. It is $8.59. Then I'm gonna grab some of this downy wrinkle release spray for $3.19. Then I'm going to grab a Band-Aid antiseptic cleansing on the go spray. I'm just a mess here. And then all of my items will equal out to $20.77. I have a three off of 10 and a two off of 10 trial and travel size CRT. Those thresholds for the CRTs is $10 plus $10. So I can use both of those on this. That'll bring my total down to $15.77. I'll get back a $5 extra buck, making my total $10.77. But we're using that 32% off your next purchase CRT, so it'll make it much cheaper. So next we're gonna grab the Dr. Scholl's. The Dr. Scholl's is by two. Get back a $5 extra buck, and we're going to grab a callus and a corn remover at $8.49 a piece. That'll bring our total up to $16.98. We're gonna use two $3 off coupons that come from the 612 save inserts, and that'll bring our total down to $10.98, but we'll get back a $5 extra buck. Then we're going to submit our receipt to Ibotta and get back $2 on each one of them, making them $1.98 or 99 cents a piece. Now, all of these items here, except the Hallmark bags, are what I'm grabbing for my 32% off transaction. Stay tuned till the end, and you'll see how much that took off. Next, we're going to do an oral care scenario where we combine a few oral care promotions to get the most bang for our buck. So we're going to grab the mouthwash here. It is $4.49, and they're buy to get back a $5 extra buck. I am going to show you all the coupons after I grab everything, but you can do it differently where you can grab two toothbrushes or two mouthwashes and use a digital coupon and then you can submit to the coupons.com app for the other one. I'm doing it this way and I think it, it's just the easiest way to do this. So then we're going to grab some Crest. The Crest is on promotion where you buy two, 
you get back a four dollar extra buck so i am grabbing the crest 3d white charcoal the 3.8 ounce it is very important that you grab this particular kind so that the glitch will happen so we're just going to grab these two then we're going to grab some colgate the colgate that is two for 7.98 and there's no extra buck back for this we just have a high value digital coupon and this will help get us to the threshold that we need to be to use our crt so our total for everything is 28.94 we're going to use a seven off two digital for the colgate toothpaste we're going to use a five off two digital coupon for the crest and a two off two digital coupon that will glitch with that we're also going to use a dollar digital for the colgate toothbrush and a dollar for the colgate mouthwash digital coupon then we have a five off 25 oral care crt that'll bring your total down to seven dollars and 94 cents but you'll get back a five dollar extra buck for the colgate and a four dollar extra buck for the crest making them free and a dollar and six cent money maker now originally when i did the math my crest totals were just over five dollars and there was a lot bigger money maker but for me it's still a money maker and i'll take it and the last thing we are grabbing is the neutrogena it is spend 30 get back a 10 dollar extra buck i am going to be grabbing two of the hydro boost cleansers here for 11 dollars 29 cents a piece then i am going to be grabbing a hydro boost wipe for seven dollars and 49 cents that will bring our total up to thirty dollars and seven cents we're going to use two two dollar off coupons that come in the seven ten save insert and a dollar digital coupon for the wipes i also have a five off of 25 neutrogena hydro boost crt that'll bring my total down to twenty dollars and seven cents i'll get back a ten dollar extra buck and then I'll also submit my receipt to Ibotta. I'll get back $2 for each one of the cleansers and a dollar for one of the wipes. Making the total for all three products, just $5.07, which I think is a pretty good deal for three Neutrogena face products. So that is everything. Let's go out to the vehicle and discuss all the transactions and look at the receipts. All right, guys, we are back in from CVS, and I think everything went great. I had no problems with my paper coupons. Um, the only issue I had, of course, was my Tide coupon not working. So then they, they had to adjust it down and all that jazz, and I had to reissue me an extra buck because it took it below the $30 mark. That's okay. I have no problem with that at all. So let's talk about the curbside pickup order now. So I got this right here when I asked for my order. Inside the bag is three of those first aid cases. That was the freebie on Sunday. And this is a really nice case. Um, if you don't mind that it says CBS Health on it. I seen Llewellyn, how she used hers. And that is so brilliant. You can use it for like a little coupon binder if you want um, and inside is just some you know it's just an empty little case but anyways I got three I didn't think I would get three because I did get three of those CRTs on one of my accounts so I, I got three of them uh, I didn't think I'd get three honestly I was hoping I'd get three but if I got one I would be happy if they didn't cancel my order you know what I mean but I was lucky enough to get three and I don't know what I'm gonna do with these yet but I'm going to do something creative with them I probably will build some you know period kits and drop them off at the high school in my town so I think that would be a good idea and this is something that they can keep on them to hold pads whatever in their lockers so I think that's a really good idea so since I got three of them, what happened was is there is also a deal going on right now for first eight items that when you spend $12, you get back a $3 extra buck. And getting three of these, of course they were $11.97, but I got them for free. But then I got back a $3 extra buck, making them free and a $3 money maker. So that is amazing. They're all blue super cute i think even if it says cbs health in there i don't care when i posted that on my community tab there was a lot of people that were upset they didn't get the crt or their stores were out already on sunday morning and the thing of it is is and it's not just cvs is all stores do this 
is that they put out a freebie or a sale or something like that and then they put like three in the store and it's like come on guys if you want to have a sale stock your stores with that item and you will make a lot more money and not have as many mad customers um, there was still some on the store shelf in my store for the cases so it is what it is with that deal a lot of people are on both sides of the fence with clearing the shelves. I have never really said my opinion about shelf clearing. It really doesn't bother me. Couponing is a game. Couponing is a puzzle and you win some, you lose some. It is a race and that is what it is. And I just, I got lucky. And I gotta say, a lot of times I don't get lucky. I'm not a clearance chaser. I'm not anything like that. And if you are, that's awesome. But uh, I just never have any luck with that. So I'm happy that I was able to get lucky this time around. So there is that. Now let's talk about the numbers. So I have four different transactions. They were pretty small transactions. One of them was way too expensive for a typical CVS transaction, but I really, really wanted this item. And it was that Kristen S shampoo and conditioner. They got me on that. Thankfully, I had rebate money uh, to help cover the cost for that. So that's why it wasn't that big of a deal to me. But I know a lot of CVS couponers probably wouldn't do this deal because it is expensive. That transaction, I also got the gift wrap and the Tylenol. So here is my receipt for that transaction. I had the $2 Tylenol coupon. I had a four off 18 hair care CRT, a three off two Hallmark CRT, three $2 off Kristen S CRTs. So the Kristen S coupon and the Tylenol coupon are instant coupons, but for some reason this week, people are getting multiples of things. So I got three Kristen S coupons. Then I also got three $1 off coupons for the Motrin or Tylenol. Then I had a 40% off one item. Thankfully, it came off the Kristen S. So that took off another $4.72. That brought my total down to $23.43. Now I paid that with rebate money on my PayPal account. So I had no problems paying that. But then I got back a $6 extra buck making that transaction $18.46, which like I said, most people will not get this deal because it is so expensive. So we can count that or we cannot count that in today's transaction. That is up to you. So then the next transaction I had the travel items, the Dr. Scholl's, the Essie nail polish, and the Cetaphil. Now with this transaction, I had a 32% off coupon that was emailed to me, and that meant 32% off my entire purchase. So on this account, I got some deals that I wanted to get that you didn't really have CRTs for. The only thing is, is you cannot pay with extra bucks. So it's kind of a catch-22. It's a good amount off, but if you can't pay with extra bucks, then you know what I mean? So that's why it was a little funky for me this week. I didn't have the CRTs, but I had percentage off CRTs anyways. So on this transaction, I had two $3 coupons and that would be for the Dr. Scholl's. And then I had two $4 printables for the Cetaphil. I had a three off 10 trial or travel CRT. I had a $3 off GSQ CRT for beauty tools, which included the nail files. Then I had four $2 off SE nail polish CRTs. Then I had a two off 10 trial or travel CRT. Um, and because my threshold was $20, I was able to use a, both of those. Then I had a dollar off GSQ app only coupon. And then I had that 32% off CRT took off $14.02. So I paid $29.79. I got back a $4 extra buck for the GSQ. I got back a $4 extra buck for the Cetaphil. I got back a $5 extra buck for the Dr. Scholl's and a $5 extra buck for the trial and travel size item. Then I got back $9 on Ibotta, $4 for the Dr. Scholl's, $2 for each one and $5 for the Cetaphil, $2.50 for each one. And that brought my total down to $2.79. Now, typically when we have the trial and travel size deals, I don't ever get them because 
the out of pocket is pretty high but with the 32% off CRT I thought you know what they're full price items I'll be able to get the 32% off of those and two dollars and 79 cents for some of those items I am so happy for so I'm really happy with how that transaction went then with the next transaction I have the Tide and the CVS first aid items and the Maybelline and I need a drink I've been drinking liquid IV with this heat and I feel amazing drinking it so just a little tidbit there. So anyways, for this transaction, I had all of my paper coupons come off totally fine. This was the one where I had the issue with the Tide coupon, but we know how that goes. So I had a dollar digital coupon for the Downy fabric softener. I had the $3 off CRTs for my free CVS first aid item. Now only two of those come off because my total after everything was zero. So they couldn't keep giving me the $3 off because my total was zero. I also had the eight off of 40 CRT come off. I had the four off 20 Maybelline come off and I had a $3 off Maybelline mystery coupon come off as well. Then I used my care pass and I also used $2 and two cents in the 2% and extra buck rewards back as well. So not including my extra bucks, my total was $22 exactly. I got back a $10 extra buck for the Tide, a $3 extra buck for the First Aid, and a $5 extra buck for the Maybelline. I also got back $2 on Ibotta for the Maybelline green item, um, green edition item. So then that made my transaction for this one just $2. And I'm really, really happy with that. So. I'll take it. I'll take $2 for a bottle of Tide in today's world. So then we got one more transaction and that includes the Neutrogena and the oral care deal that I did. I was also gonna do Cottonelle, but my store only had one blue Cottonelle. So I could have got the Viva, but I was just like, you know what? It's not there. I'm not gonna force it. So on this transaction, I just used two $2 paper coupons from the inserts for the Neutrogena. I had the $2 Crest Digital coupon come off. I had the $5 Crest Digital come off. I had a $7 Colgate coupon come off. A dollar Neutrogena Digital coupon come off. So my Crest did glitch, so that's awesome. Then I had my free CVS first aid item on this account. That's why I got the spray alcohol. I love getting those. Although I don't think I showed you that. But anyways, I got the spray alcohol for $3.59. It was a really beat up one, but you know what? I like those. Then I had a five off 25 oral care CRT and a five off 25 Neutrogena Hydro Boost CRT. I also had a care pass on this account. I do have care passes on all of my accounts. Totally worth it, even if you have multiple accounts. Then I had that um, 2% back that I wanted to use because it's $2.41. That is just free money. And then three cents for the 20% off the care pass for the rubbing alcohol. That brought my total down to $15 or, oops. That brought my total down to $5.16. But with my extra bucks, then so then that made my total $18.16. Um, but I only paid $5.16 out of pocket, if you know what I mean. Sometimes I don't do that with every single transaction, how I explain that. But when I'm telling you what my total is, that's how much it is without the extra bucks. So my total is $18.16. I got back a $10 extra buck for the Neutrogena, a $5 extra buck for the... A five dollar extra buck for the Colgate and a four dollar extra buck for the Crest. I got back five dollars on Ibotta for the Neutrogena items. Now when I scanned those wipes it showed no offers found but when I submitted my receipt um, it showed that I had a dollar for the wipes so I got five dollars back on Ibotta. Now since my digitals didn't come off and I probably didn't clip them since those didn't come off for the Colgate mouthwash and toothbrush, 
I'm going to submit my receipt to the coupons.com app and get back $2 there, making my transaction free in a $7.84 moneymaker. Yes, indeedy. So I'm so happy that I got a moneymaker. So with my pickup order being a moneymaker and that transaction being a moneymaker, it's a good day. So, my total for everything, not including that lovely Kristen S, making everything free in a $6.05 moneymaker. And I am so happy that that is my total. And I just didn't think it was going to come through. So, you never know. You never know and never hold out because you just don't know what's going to happen. But that is really all I have. So let me know about the Procter & Gamble coupons. Let me know what freebie items you've gotten so far uh, at CVS. And that is really all I have. So don't forget, there is a Google Doc linked down below in the description box to use. And thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you have a great day. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. All right, guys, so we are back in from CVS, and I don't think there was really any issues. I think everything went great. Now, I talked to, burr, I told Kristen S. CRTs. Uh, we're only, you, we typically only get one, but this week, and a lot of people I get, be get, blah, blah. So, <sighs> So anyways, with this transaction, I'm pointing way over here for my receipt.